Yo, what's going on? It's OD and I'm back with another video. Today I got a flash drive for you. Not just a regular flash drive. This flash drive works for all the devices out there. This works for iPad, iPhone, Android. Even works for Windows phones. Alright? Don't have it on there, but it does. Alright? So basically, this device right here has two ports. Alright? Has the USB side and it has the lightning connected side. On the light on the USB side, you can um, flick it off and then turns into a micro USB which is official all right so let's go to the back right here it shows you right here for Android you flick it back and it turns into a uh, micro USB then you have for PC and then you have for iPhones these are the devices it says it works with so you already know once it's lightning connected it works for anything lightning the connector period and it's a USB 2.0 because Android can't do 3.0 right now without changing devices <clears throat> All right, so here we go. So we have the lightning connector side, and then we have the USB side. And as you can see here, you pull this back, boom, and now you have the micro USB. Official. So let's try this thing out, one of my phones. Put one of my phones out right here. All right, so we're going to plug this thing on up here. Boom. See the light flashing? Now it's asking you, do you allow? You say yes. Boom. Downloads the app and give you everything in here. So here's the button you'll press to go into iPhone pictures. Let me make sure I censor this. You know what I mean? So here's a picture right here. We have basically um, click on that. So you go to edit. Then we go to select all. Or you could just click on it, whatever you want. Just click on it if you want and then you just go to export and then external drive so then you'll send a picture over to the external drive so then go to the external drive you basically will go to external of course this is the memory for your phone this is the memory for the external drive so you go to external and then basically as you can see here you go to photos and then you'll see the picture that you just put in alright so now let's try it on the Android <clears throat> So I got my big boy toy here with me today. So we're gonna pull out the Android side, flack that down, flack it, flack it, plug it up. All right, boom. So we on. So basically, it's gonna register. Give it a moment. There you go. So now you have the Android folder. Automatically it makes the Android folder when you um, basically plug it in. That's any drive that works with the phones. I have other ones that I sell. Um, I just got these in. So um, basically that that's going to all be automatic. It's going to make an Android folder. So that way you know exactly where your stuff is at separated from you know the iOS. But the only thing I see here was you can't transfer from iOS to the Android. You have to make sure this stuff is put into the Android folder. So I'm gonna do a little tests and whatnot to make sure that um, it works when you do that. But so far, as you can see, it's official, it works. I mean, um, all right, yeah. So you go into the data here, you go into everything that makes a little folders for you, depending on what you have on your device or whatnot. And basically, that's really it. So you can send over your pictures, your videos, everything that you have on your device to here even contacts you know what i mean so you can make a little fo file and send it over to contacts and everything like that so you can back up all your stuff so this is official now the only thing i really don't like about it so far is that it doesn't lock you see it doesn't lock so when you plug it into your device you must hold it firmly and plug it in same thing here when you use the micro usb the micro usb is a little tougher because you know it has a fit within these prongs right here so it's a little more tough so basically you know you want to make sure that you firmly put it in without trying to scratch up the, your device you know what I mean so this is basically a good thing to have for iOS I would think so for most Android phones you have a USB you have the um, micro SD card but just in case you want things off the card not in the phone you want it in your hand or you want to store it somewhere for later this would be perfect you know so that's it for right now. That's all I got for you. And, um, you know, please like and subscribe. If you have any questions about it, 
um, where to get them from or how much they cost or if you would like to order from me just let me know and um, that's basically it I'll highlight y'all later